I always get envy when I see Mike and Denise. Here they are just traveling the world on a motorcycle and they've taken us to some amazing places. But where did it all start off? Well, it started off at the Himalayas and Mike and Denise take us back there. Everything started in the Himalayas for you, didn't it? And now you're still running a trip there after all these years. Yeah, the Himalayan Heights is where it all started. I discovered more or less by accident the, uh, the route that we now do on a regular basis, our Himalayan Heights tour. And, uh, and we now still run pretty much that same program many, many years later. We do the highest road in the world, which is in the Indian Himalayan region of Kashmir. How do people feel when they get up the top there? It's a very popular destination these days. The highest road in the world is 5,600 metres. Mm -hmm. As you might imagine, when people get to the top of the Kadungla, as it's known, they're a bit short on breath, but high on exhilaration. There's usually high fives and a little bit of a yahoo. Not many places in the world offer the opportunity to travel to 5,000 metres and beyond on a motorcycle. And to get there, we've come across the three other highest passes in the world. So, you know, there's an enormous sense of achievement to finally be at the pinnacle. Quite frankly, you just feel invincible. You can do anything. And one thing I remember <laughs> from when I did it with you guys was the trip back down with the engine off. And was it 37 kilometres? If you get it right, you don't have to start your engine for 37 kilometres till you get to the bottom. Yeah, take off from the top with a bit of a run up, find angel gear, kick it into neutral, turn the ignition off and sit back and see how far you can go. What did you first think of a Royal Enfield when you rode one? I had nothing else to gauge it by because I'd never been on any other motorcycle in my life. So I jumped on an Enfield and I thought, this is fantastic. <laughs> what an introduction this, to motorcycles. This is the most powerful thing on the planet. I've got to say, it's exactly the right pace for going up through those mountains, which have got to be one of the most spectacular places in the world. Mm -hmm. The views are sensational. Imagine. Absolutely. Around every corner is a new vista. The infield certainly is an integral part of that tour. It adds to the specialness of it. You kind of putt, putt, putt slowly up those hills and down the other side, but it gets you up there reliably and down the other side, and there's just an enormous sense of majesty, not like anywhere else in the world, and it doesn't matter how many times we've both been there, it never diminishes. 